Now, Egan Warming Centers will still use the Trinity United Methodist Church, as you heard, as a warming site, even though it did abruptly close its doors. They've been using the church for years. And KZI 9 News reporter Noah Chavez is live tonight from the church to explain how that could change in the future. Noah. Renee, Egan told me that they're going to be able to use the center for the entire duration of the wintertime season. Now, this comes as great news for the neighbors who are used to seeing the warming center being used. Now that's going to be operating throughout the entire winter season. However, the fate of the building itself has yet to be revealed as we have no information at this time. With below freezing temperatures expected for the next few nights, the center will be business as usual for the volunteer staff and more importantly, the people in need of heat. Emergency response coordinator Tim Black says his initial reaction to being told of the clo church's closure was shock, but says he has been personally assured by the church that they can continue with their operations. Uh, church has made me aware of ongoing challenges that they've had over the past year and Egan Warming Center has remained welcome and that's been made clear to us again this year that you're welcome all winter um, long term they can't make any um, promises but um, they say we're welcome here all winter and and that's wonderful with everything else going on and all the challenges uh, we really do appreciate that. Black added that since the closure his team is already searching for replacement locations after the current winter season ends, saying that having to find a new location isn't uncommon for his staff. Now, Black says, or rather coming up on KZI 9 News at 8, Black explains how important it was to be able to keep this warming center open ahead of such frigid temperatures. Reporting live in Eugene, Noah Chavez, KZI 9 News.